everybody. Today's lesson, we're going to be making a stamp and we're going to be using what everybody has been looking for this whole time we've been away from each other. And that's toilet paper and we're going to use toilet paper rolls. Of course it can be paper towel rolls. We're also going to be using paint if you have it. Watercolor would work too. Uh, it would work best probably the way I'm going to use it with marker. So please don't worry if you do not have um, paint at home. You may use a marker. Alright, so again, I just feel better um, here. I'm going to show you and I'm going to turn myself off. And here we go. Okay, so those of you who do not have at home, no worries. Um, you can use the shape that it has. Now I want to make several and cut it in half, which is what this is. This is paper towel cut in half. Okay, so this side just take and you're gonna color around the edge. It is um, water based, it's not dry, so we can make prints. You can see, this is kind of a, mm, like a lemon. <laughs> okay, so I just kept going that way. Of course, you can keep coloring, <clears throat> excuse me, coloring it. this same one, but I'm going to flip it because I can still use it. I could cut it, but I'm going to flip it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So this seems like it wants to Nice. Okay, so I'm going to do it again. I'm going to keep the example with the marker, and then when I'm finished with that, I will do the one with paint. this for this much. All right. I have an idea though. Please don't feel like you have to stop there. That purple. Putting that together. The cylinders. Of course you can keep the, um, the print just the way you made it. You don't have to do this. Okay, but it just occurred to me while I was making it, like, oh, nice way to make some cylinders. Okay, so that's the way with the marker, decorated, keep adding more to it, whatever you'd like. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to do it with, um, excuse me, with uh, the paint. All right, <clears throat> now at paint, make sure you're you have your area covered and not mess up anything from your parents, please. Okay, so let's take these. I'm going to cut. I'm going to cut. And I'm going to make. Let's see. We can bend it. It can be a certain shape that you like. Make one up. Let's see what I'm making here. I'm gonna have to pinch my 
shapes first. So I'm going to make that one. You know what? That's a perfect oval. I'm going to keep that oval. And cut more so you can share with brothers and sisters or so that you have <clears throat> enough for another project. Let's see this one. This one, let's make fringe and make it look like a flower. So <clears throat> that's what we're going to do here. Just going to make a few samples because on the lesson I will place and put some pictures of different ideas you can do with your toilet paper rolls. to make oh I like that it's like a teardrop mm, no <laughs> should have left it alone okay so I'm gonna leave oh there we go let's leave that heart all right so let's go ahead Pull these out. And remember, these are just ideas. Get you started and then perfect. Boom, it's got on the other side. Okay, so I've got mine. 